What's going on, guys? And before we start today's episode, um, I have something to seriously uh, t talk about right now. Uh, recently, I found a video about Scott Gotham, the creator of Finance of Freddy's, and uh, he's currently uh, getting canceled by Twitter, of course, who uh, by just by sharing his personal beliefs, his religious and his political beliefs, and he's getting death threats. And of course, there are another problem. Not really going to do it, but I suggest that you should you should still go show Scott Cawthon love and support to what he's going through in his family. Scott Cawthon does not deserve this. He is. One of the best creators I know. Um, I don't play all of their games because I'm too scared to play them myself. But I really want you guys to go and just show him love, support, anything you can do for him. I'm probably gonna title this video "I Stand by Scott" just because I really do believe you, uh, you guys need to support him because he does not deserve getting hated on because of the, what he believes in. No one usually should, but th this, I don't believe he should. Just by his standing by its principles. And that his wife is six weeks pregnant. Like I said, just please show love, support, anything. To show lo that love and support for him. Because he just doesn't deserve what he's getting. He's a good guy. He really is. He's a good guy. He's donated to so many great charities. He's donated to St. Jude who to find a cure. He's he's a good man. <laughs> and I hate to see him go through something that he doesn't deserve to go through. You know. It just it's wrong. It's wrong no matter what. So like I said, please, please, please go so go so show some love and support for him. Anyway, uh well, no, I really don't know how to start the rest of the uh go with the rest of the video because I really do feel Pretty, pretty mad about this one. Got the guy called was one of those creators who always seemed Where's my family, asshole? like a good guy, we like actually good. We need the vet. Just by oh, his personality, vet. by Please, I've seen him in uh, Daco's interview, and he seems like a good guy. And go to no, he donated a hundred thousand dollars to. Um, St. Jude just over a joke for MatPat, I think it was. It says who the world works now. Get part of yourself. Just please show him any love, any support. Because he doesn't deserve it's not the answer. Aren't the walkers eating enough of us? You gotta keep me alive. None of it. He deserves none of it. Kill me. The meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. I don't know how to go off of it. This is not how the world works uh, now. I don't know how you to continue an episode after you. that. Um, start, you. but you and Kenny murder my dad, but you leave this piece of it's shit just, alive. It just feels something I personally just hate seeing. Someone who's a good guy just expressing oh his opinion about him. what his beliefs, gotcha. his beliefs are. Is just getting hated please, on. No. For absolutely no fucking reason. It's... I, I hate seeing this shit. Just for someone trying to stand up to their beliefs and getting hated on because of it. Regardless of what he believes in or... Regardless of what he believes in or not. It, it always bothers me to see he's getting death threats because of it. That's never okay. I don't give a damn what you are. He's getting death threats because he believes in what he believes in. That's not fucking okay. I don't know, it bothers me, it generally fucking bothers me to see that. Kitty. To see someone who is a good dude, I, who I actually kind of seen as one of my favorite, I think, creators now. My favorite creator, uh, seeing what his beliefs are. He just says, I don't, I don't know, he just pisses me off to see that shit. You know, it's kind of like if Markiplier ever got into this, one of these situations, I would be pissed off too. Because, you know, Mark Clark is a good dude. He still doesn't deserve this shit. No one deserves getting you fucking death threats just because of what you believe in. Regardless of who you are. Barley. I, I know, sorry, I said that. I just... Me? 
It bothers me. It just bo bothers the shit out of me. See that happens. So please, you guys, show your love and your support for him. Please, please, go to a sporting show. Show your love. Show your support. When you guys didn't come back, I figured something was up. What can we do? Larry's Wait, dead. I, I they don't chopped know off Mark's legs and tried to feed him to continue, us. Continue uh, the rest of the episode. Is everyone else okay? They still got Duck and Katja in the yeah, house. It's... And I don't know where the fuck Kenny uh, is. I don't know if All I right. can. We're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go yeah, I don't know if it's easy, really. There's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. I don't know, it's just Thanks an odd us. thing to see. Be careful. You know, because just... Uh, I mean, I've seen it before with, like, uh, who's another YouTuber who recently just got shitted on for no reason? Steven Crowder? I like him, and he got shitted on for no fucking reason. Uh, just... Steven Crowder seemed like a good dude, and he got sh shat on recently. Yeah, again, he, I like Steven Crowder, he can hand handle it pretty fucking well. He knows how to give shit back, too. Scott's not, uh, the guy, he's generally worried for his family, and... I, I feel bad for him because Where he doesn't deserve what's going on because he, he seems like a, just a nice guy and he is a nice guy from everything I've seen Please get back. Don't come in here. Go Brenda Come on now, you know you don't want to do this. Just go yeah, I, I don't know if I can genuinely talk about the game right now because I'm still baffled. Right people want just to hate him because of because he's a Christian. That's why they want to you know, about hate him you pretty do. much. He's a, he's a Christian and they like want to hate him because of that. And it's I'll fucking kill her, stupid. Lee. Just let me go. Don't do I don't usually get put over the, or have a. Uh, what what happened, Brenda? Uh, Your family was obviously smart. Channel, how, but it, how did uh, it that's come to this? Bothering the shit out of me because if you did generally something fucked up, maybe. But again, he. I don't want to kill you, Lee. This this dairy was your pride. Look what you've done to it. Yeah, right now I just can't handle like. Who the fuck do you I mean, it just bothers me to see someone. Look at what you done. I don't know. You brought this on yourself. No, uh, uh, you did this. All we wanted just... was a little gas to keep ourselves safe. <laughs> it just bothers me some. My two eyes getting death threats. The one person who shouldn't be getting fucking death threats is getting death threats. Yes. Fucking stupid. I did want to. I was thinking about making a commentary video about this, and this may turn into one. I don't know, but. Man, it, 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 it's getting to me. You know, it's not like someone went and said something stupid. Or went and hurt people. He's just expre expressing his opinions. His opinions, his beliefs. And, although I don't share my beliefs a lot on this channel because I'm not a I don't like to reveal that much personal information about myself I, I, I just hate seeing death threats regardless of who you are Lily, help! not sure I have given death threats to people in video games but they're not real and that's a fucking difference okay true I don't like James because of his stupid ass belief but it, it's it's fictional, okay? It, there, there's a difference. It's fucking fictional. Uh, I, like, I don't even really want to knock this dude out right now. Uh, uh, one more, one, one more.
Is that all you got, Lee? <laughs> you ain't shit! It's over! Fuck you! As soon as Danny and Mama get out here, you're, you're all fucked! <laughs> They're not coming. What do you mean? Lee? What the fuck do you mean? Yeah, I just say yeah, I I don't know how I can say this episode right Don't now. you dare walk away from me, Lee! Even if it was someone who I didn't like. Get back here and I finish wouldn't, this, Lee! I wouldn't want them to get death threats. And that's one of the things bothering me the most. If you were just getting shit or just hate, then whatever. Fucking internet get people give you shit over nothing. Like a man, Lee. But to get death threats is where it bothers me. Lee. Or just again, if you just said something, you just said what you believe in, and people just give you shit for it, whatever. But then it, but when the death threats start happening, is where it becomes Lee. a fucking problem. Let's go. Yeah, I know this isn't like the most cheery episode I've done, but I don't know how I can be super cheery about what's going on in the real world right now about that. That that that's bothering me. I know he's also just hey Lee, I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended. A good guy who wants to do right yeah. and I'm glad you showed up when you did. He's just getting shit you haven't taken that shot of it. We might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing yeah, people? Yeah, this is like fucking ISIS or something, or or whatever, or someone I who just yeah, and Clementine almost ate something. I'm like a bad, I don't know who's like a but shitty person that I don't like too well. I can't leave her alone. Or at least someone I personally don't like. Wait, Lee, if Lee, even if Leafy, no, I kind of like Leafy in a weird way. Caught not in like a, like I like him, but she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Who, who do I not really like? Yeah. Like I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Who do I like not like on YouTube? Uh, you Ethan Kellen. Yeah, Sometimes I don't really care for him. Even if Ethan Kellen was getting on. this shit, I wouldn't want him. I would still say, hey, uh, he shouldn't be getting fucking death threats. Although I don't really like Ethan. It's the H three H three. I don't really like him anymore because he's just an huh? angry fucking old man music. now. I just, I would still say, hey, you know. Although I don't support him anymore, be fallout. please. He does not deserve the death threats. If, if this was Lily's him, dead. I would say don't yeah, give him death threats. I would imagine so. What do you think? Because he just this is somebody who just doesn't deserve it. I'm with you, Kenny. We'll do what has to be done. You're damn right. And if no one deserves death threats, regardless of who you are, just about ready to roll. And that's what's bothering me. I know it's the internet and people say that shit all the time, but okay. when it comes to, yeah. but considering. It's Twitter, and you shared. Stay close. And uh, you shared you were um, not on uh, their political side. Oh boy, it gets bad for you. Okay, it, it gets fucking terrible. We didn't kill them, so I don't know. They might have been able to get away from. Yeah, it gets pretty bad for you. But I'm sure they won't be coming after us. That's good. Hey, Dad, what's that noise? Sounds like a car. Oh god, not more strangers. Hmm. Don't shoot! We're here to help! Possibly. Yeah, like I said, I don't, I don't know how to continue this episode because it's just... 
It's just one of those things. Like, I, I don't know. I mean, we've gone 15 minutes so far. Figures. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. And, uh, I do hope that this does become bigger and people do show this more support. Could save all of us. Uh, in fact, not all of us. Find videos that you can, you know, uh, find, uh, get people you know to show them support. I don't know if these people are you know, kids. just give this guy support because he made such back, great games. He's monsters who came out of the woods. Great games. He's a great guy. He's this done a lot of good Dad, in this world. Dead. He's helped so many people. Don't worry about that. Duck. Sick people who ours, couldn't get help beforehand get the help they they got. It's not. Like I believe in St. Jude. Uh, what charity stream with MatPat. He donated a lot of money that gave a whole year to them, or a whole month, or something like that. He gave me a whole year or a whole month we uh, have of it. I can't remember which one it is, we but he gave him a whole year or month Who says of all supplies for them. Hey, that doesn't. That no one like does that. Not, not everyone would do, would do something like that, but he will. That tells you who the kind of guy Scott Gawson is. Scott Gawson is a good man. And it depresses me seeing this shit. I mean, I wouldn't expect anything less knowing the, the world's so fucked up. But it still kind of breaks my heart to see. That's such a good guy's getting that Great. shit. Maybe we'll survive this after all. Doc, why don't you carry this? Okay. Supplies? I'll pick it. More food in here. Like I can just uh, I don't know it, 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 we just it, it just I'll carry it. This hoodie looks to be about your size. Why don't you hold on to this? It might just surprises me to see that shit. It's not mine. Just please. We're not like the bandits, honey. We didn't hurt anybody. Please just this. go show them support, show them love, show, get so. people, get people you know, and show them support because. He did so much good for this world, and we actually uh, show some goodness to him now. He helped so many people who couldn't hey, give help for. You know, he's kind of like. You know, if Here, if Wigan somehow gets a Mr. Some Beast or someone like that, just to kind of help him out, think you can handle because those? he's just spreading You're his. You're not gonna let opinion. me live that down, are you? There's something. I don't know. Lee, yes. you're gonna want to see this. It, it, it just, I, I just hate seeing this shit. Oh shit! Anyway, I think that might, I think that's all I'm gonna say for that. Like I said, it's just, I, I don't know how to talk about. Yeah, you know, I don't know how to. I, I don't know. But I, I have to get my thoughts out there for this episode because it's just bothering me. It's badly bothering me about this, and I just watched it. And I don't, and this is no, there's no script to this, alright? This is all coming from the heart, so. Like I said, I don't, I don't know what to say. I don't. I know I've kind of disputed the same message night, for 19 minutes, but. Okay. And he's what just. I don't know. To Can you just share it? who you sure. who. When did you lose it? What you believe I in. To believe. I promise. If I find it, I'll safe. let you know. Sit just to get shit. Like shit on because you believe. The dead don't kill their own. Because you, you be believe in something. Or you're and you're gonna or you're getting shit on because who you voted for. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep I hate seeing it regardless. I hate seeing this and getting death threats because of it. It doesn't fully surprise me, sadly, because I see this happening a lot recently, but just to see it, to, to Scott pains me. Like, if you saw it to another YouTuber, then uh, whatever, the fucking YouTuber. But this is a guy who has a normal day-to-day -day life, who made so many great games, who helped 
so many people and this is what he fucking gets in return and, it, and I'm so glad I am seeing the fan base is against the hate, the hate, uh, the death threats. They are for him. They're showing a lot of love. I just want to show more love to this guy. This town is tapped. I said I generally do support Scott Cawthon as a person. So please show him as much love as you can. Anything. It's starting to add up. I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this. Now I said this for 20 minutes. Man, I, I don't know what else to say. So I, I think I had saw this episode. He did kill her dad. Probably Brother Clementine. The people out there got their mind up. I stand by Scott. Scott. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes they yeah. do. This is crazy. I'm the one keeping this group going. We can sort this all out, all right? We can sort this out. I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else. <laughs> There it is, the end for this episode. Yeah, I'm sorry, like, again, this isn't the most cheery episode. I just, that that's just been lingering on my mind for a good few minutes, or, and, or less, probably maybe hour or a half, something like that. It's just, it's bothering me bad. Uh, I, I don't know, it, it, it bothers me to see this. But I am glad we are seeing... A lot of love, a lot of support on other other people's, uh, people's channels. I saw a lot, a lot of love and support on uh, uh, Candy Cadet's channel, or or is it new uh, FNAF News, something like that, uh, FNAF World, something like that. I don't remember. Uh, I don't know the channel name, but the guy who uh, plays with the boys for uh, Candy Cadet kind of tells all this, and he showed everything he believes in. And, Thank you guys for watching, watching this episode. I don't know how to end this one. I just feel just... I feel bad for him. Because he doesn't deserve it. I feel bad for him because he just doesn't deserve anything. He doesn't deserve that. He does deserve all the love and support. And just because he... And I'm sure some people are also probably probably pissed off about the game delays and and I'm sure there's some people also who are pissed off because of the game delays which he's fucking out of control of that too because he, he just made the it just kind of came at an inconvenient time during a world pandemic which is thankfully we're getting a grasp on now I think it's just I don't know man I just I don't know. I, I just wish he didn't get this. You know, I, I just wish someone like Scott didn't get this. I wish he didn't get this. He does not deserve it. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of the Walking of the Road to Clementine ser series. I I don't even know if I could call this a part of the series or just a standalone episode, or maybe put it in the playlist, but don't call it that because this isn't a road to Clementine. Okay, apparently a fan just died. Yeah, you know what? That's okay. I don't know what to say, man. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Scott, if you somehow watch this, man, I love you. Support your work. I love a lot of your work and I hope you and your family are safe. And, uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Uh, I, I'm not going to say the normal outro at this point because I don't feel right saying it about what I'm talking about. Just thank you guys so much for watching. Please show them support. Uh, I'll hopefully see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.